hey 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 welcome back to my channel today i'm bringing to you the egyptian bread this is also known as the lebanese bread and um, it is also called the arabian bread i must say that people of northern africa also eat this type of bread so basically it's like a you know a middle eastern northern african kind of food without wasting much time let's just get started first of all i'll get my yeast this is about 10 grams i will add in a teaspoonful of sugar then I'll cover it up with some warm water. I'll come in with a plastic wrap and leave it alone to rise. Now I'll get my all-purpose flour. I'm using 250 grams of flour. Then I'll come in with a pinch of salt to taste. I'll grate in some nutmeg. Then I'll come in with about five tablespoons full of olive oil. As you can see, our yeast has risen, so I'll just add it to the flour. I'll come in with a little bit of warm water and I'll keep on mixing till I get a dough. Now it's mixed up very well so it's time to come in with our hands. With the help of my palm, I'll just knead it up. So I'll knead for about 10 minutes. After it has mixed up very well, I'll put it in a bowl, cover it up with a plastic wrap and leave it alone to rise for about 2 hours. So it's been after 2 hours and as you can see it's risen very well. I'll dust my working board with some flour and I'll put my dough on it. I'll divide those into 4 pieces. With the help of a rolling pin, I will just shape it up into a circle. I must say, I never get the perfect circle, but this is okay. We can manage it. So well, basically, I'll do the same thing with all the four pieces. Now I'll put a pan on fire and I'll come in with my shaped dough. I'll leave this to cook on low fire. I'll cook each side for about 2 minutes. So as you can see our flatbread is ready so I'll just get it out of the pan. And I'll keep it in a clean napkin and cover it up. This will help trap in the moisture. So this is what I'll do with the rest of the dough. So after everything, this is what we have here. Our Egyptian flatbread is ready. I'll just come in with a little bit of parsley and some olive oil. And look guys, look at how soft it is. You can just fold them up. And I must tell you, it tastes delicious as well. I must say, you can make a lot of them and keep them in the fridge. You can heat it up in a pan or in a microwave when you're ready to use it. 
so 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 i hope you enjoyed this video and i hope you are going to give this a try if you do let me know how it comes out for you you can send me pictures if you want to if you've not subscribed please don't forget to hit the subscribe button don't forget to share this with family and friends and don't forget to leave me a big fat thumbs up until next time i am going to see you with another nice and interesting one bye bye